Can you please introduce yourself, what organization you work for, why, why are you here? Hello, I am Cesar Aguilar Alcedo, representing Bolivia for the liberation of the coca leaves, the rights of the coca leaf and the right use. So let's say medical use and nutrition use and basically to fix the historic mistake because they, without scientific proofs, they catalog as a drug in the list. So with this as the speech of our vice president, we was to solution this because now we have the collaboration of Japanese doctors who with scientific proofs, they tell all the nutrition aspects of the coca leaves in many ways and with, with 100 grams of coca powder of leaves, you can have all the nutrition that human needs, especially like adults or supplements. And basically that, uh, to taking also testimonies, how this plant helps to different people in the world, around the world. Is your hat a traditional one from Bolivia? Can my you? hat, yeah, my hat is a traditional for a musician an elder musician in the traditional music of Siku, Sikuri, from the region of uh, Mokomoko, uh, Hacha Siku. No? It is handmade by, by this is the young musician player also for this tradition, ancient tradition. And in that region there is coca use? Yeah, yeah, it's part. Before we start a music practice, we start to eat shallow the liquid of the, the coca leaf ritually is part of the not toxic juice and the dialogue. What the coca helps, helps to dialogue. We think, and what our president say, the dialogue is uh, what the world needs. And the coca helps to focus, to also to compromise what compromise we make in circle for the well-being of the community or the group or the society, we discuss four elements that I said is good nutrition, good nutrition, good meditation, good work and good expression. This is a uh, benefits of the coca. If I understand you correctly, your people think that uh, coca has a sacred spiritual meaning, right? Totally, totally. Can totally. you explain that, like how? One of the este, teach is the offering, we call ofrenda. Offering comes from offer and give at the same time. Not just offers, you know, we offer and give. And when we came to our circle, Every of us bring a bag of coca leaves and beautiful handmade textile bag with beautiful patterns, each other's. And we share, before we start any talking, we share the most beautiful leaves to each one of our circle of our family members. In, this, in those leaves, we blow to print our best intentions to each of our members of our family. Let's say in the professional life, in the education, in the rising up kids, all what needs, the best intentions. And at the same time we receive, with a three or four leaves depends, the amount of leaves have different meanings. But can be four, can be two. And we receive the love of all our circle. At the same time, so this takes 
minutes, hours before anything starts. At the same time, when we receive, we eat and we start to collect in our mouth, taking the elixir of the juice, and this start to concentrate every word that comes from us after we eat the coca, start to be sacred word, like true word. All what you talk after eating is sacred. That's why it's very, very part of our spirituality. Many governments here at the UN say that coca is dangerous because uh, they produce cocaine from it and we should eradicate coca. What do you think about that? One coca leaf used for nutrition is one coca less for the narco-traffic. I can say that. What do you think? How should, how should the United Nations deal with coca? They have to listen to all the, our ancestors that we have thousands thousands of years working hard with that, helping. We can see in our art expression, we are amazing architecture expression, amazing textile, because it's concentrated in work. I think they have to read all what doctors say, because they like scientific proofs, because the spirituality not, necess not necessarily belongs to them. They need proofs, in fact. At the same time, I days prohibiting without scientific proof. That's why we consider that it's a mistake. I just recommend eat, and when they feel tired, they can try a tea bag. As our elders and ancestors, grandfathers, grandmothers made during thousands, hundreds of years. But we want for the worldwide because it's good nutrition. Every 100 grams. But let's say also there are many este, money power in the world that they don't want because the, let's say the food industry on the world is high money. So if we one little plant can supplement to all, uh, let's say food with powerful food, of course they less, less business for them. The other topic is the pharmaceutics. The pharmaceutics has a lot of money going on in the world. If one simple leaf re uh, supplant, replace many unnecessary chemicals, medicine, of course, pharmaceutical interest doesn't want. It's logic. And of course, narcotraffic also they don't want because this is a business for guns that is also important power money in the world. Simple reason. They don't want the natural use because all this money has business. This is a clear. Because this one leaf uh, from the world that Mother Earth Pachamama give to us, as our vice president say, we only, we don't live in this world. Humans, animals, and plants in our in our culture, we all share the, the weather, the air, the water. So we are kind of brother connection. That's why they, we have a low, low for the coca leaves. It's like they respect the plants and the animals. This I can say. Yeah, muchas gracias. Thank you very much. <laughs>